How's it going guys? It's Jay that Drain Guy. It's a Friday and I'm going to be starting something new today. It's going to be a full day Friday. So basically what I'm going to be doing is going through my entire day of Friday and putting up all the jobs on one video. So hopefully you guys like this and we'll see what happens throughout the day. So I'm actually on call today. So it could be a number of jobs I could be doing five jobs. I could be doing 13 jobs. So hopefully you guys like it and stick around till the end. Thanks. All right guys, this is gonna be job number one. Kitchen sink, plugged up. So we're gonna be undoing the P-trap and snaking it out and see if we pull anything back. It may just be the trap itself that's plugged up. We won't know until we open it up. We're going to be using the Milwaukee M18 drain snake. There you go, job number one done. All right guys, we're going into job number two. It's gonna be a bathtub. Let's see what we find. So we're gonna undo the overflow and snake down. the rigid K39.
So there you go. Lots of hair, but other than that, everything's good now. So uh, let's go see what we're looking at at job number three. Hey guys, so this is gonna be job number three. It's gonna be another bathtub. Let's see what we find. All right guys, we're in the bathroom here and as you can see, the bathtub is backed up. So we need to snake this out and get everything going properly. Just trying to find a good angle for you guys. So we're gonna take off the overflow, snake it down and clear everything out. These are flathead screwdrivers, or screws, I should say. Rigid K39. There you go guys, nice easy one. A little bit of hair came out. All right, so it wasn't too bad for job number three. Uh, quick in and out, everything looks good. So let's go over to job number four. All right guys, so this is gonna be job number four. It's a bathtub, it's an empty unit. They just wanna make sure everything's flowing well. Uh, so we're just gonna snake it out quickly and get everything going. So you can see everything's going good right now, but we're just gonna snake it out just to be sure. just to make sure nothing built up. As you can see, everything's running good. So this has been job number four. Let's go to job number five, see what we find. All right, so this is gonna be job number five. We're going up, we gotta take a look at a kitchen sink that's been plugged up. And we're gonna be using the M18 drain snake from Milwaukee. So let's see if we pull out anything interesting. I'm gonna take care of that for you. Yes, sir. Yeah, show you a little bit no, you're good, you're good, you're good, you're good. Do you have anything on here? Do you have anything under your sink? Yeah. yeah Alright, it's all gotta come out. Okay. I think you gotta take everything out. Yeah. Oh, I'll get that. You're good, you're good.
There you go. Job five down. Till next time. All right, guys. We're going up to number six. Job number six, that is. And apparently it's tub, toilet, and bathroom sink that's backing up. We may end up going just through the bathroom sink, all depending on how much water is there and whatnot. Um, with these units, the toilet is wall mounted. And if we pull the toilet, we're gonna get water everywhere. So a lot of times we can clear it right through the bathroom sink. Let's see what we find. Holy, look at that, eh? And the toilet as well, eh? Toilet? I don't know. Let's try. Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's okay. I'm gonna snake it from here, okay? Oh. How are you? You're good? That's good. My name is Jay. Uh, my your name? Jay. Jay. Oh, Jay. Yeah, just Jay.
What do you think? Good job. Good? <laughs> this is not my room. This is not your place? This is not my room. No? No. It's okay. My my mother being 503. Oh yeah? Yeah, I have call. Oh, thing. okay. Well, that's good. <laughs> yeah. All right, there you go, job six then. All right guys, we're going to job number seven. It's a bathroom sink. Let's see what we find. So it's a kitchen sink, not the bathroom. No, it's the bathroom. Okay. And it was backing up when you ran the water? Yeah. Yeah. But then you plunged it and you cleared it? Yeah. Okay, you seen all the rice that went down there, right? That rice is gonna get stuck in the pea trap. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's gonna, it's gonna back up. Yeah, in the morning. No, but all that rice that you just went push down there? No. It's gonna yeah. sit right there. Yeah. In the morning, no rice, no, no rice. It's the stove. No, no, I understand that. Yeah. I'm not saying that, but the rice that just went down, it's gonna block yeah. it up. If you take this out, I'll clean that out for you. Yeah. Take all this stuff out. Cause it's right there in that pea trap there. Now just grab the, the two bins out of there. You gotta watch what goes down, all right? Have a good night. Thank you. All right, there you go. A little bit of stuff in a pea trap. Uh, this went job number seven. Let's go to job number eight and see what we find there. All right, guys. This job number eight is supposed to be a plug toilet. Let's go see what we find. Hello. Hi, come on in. All right, thank you. It's a plug toilet, eh? Yeah. All right. It's not that bad. You just can't put toilet paper or anything in there. I was just about to get in the it's shower. A, it's a main washer? Yeah. Okay. So hopefully I'm not going to be too long. No, that's fine. Go ahead. Do your thing. Alright, thank you. I'm going to go in and close the door, okay? No worries. Alright, thank you. Yeah. Come on, Bubba. Oh. <laughs> What's up? How are you? Good, how are you? Good, good. You on call? Oh yeah, uh, what happened is, I put a snack. Okay. And it goes like this. If you put some paper, again it is stuck. So... Do me a favor. Ask the tenant if she has a bucket or a pail. I don't think so. Oh, just and I tried that also. What you try? Yeah, with the bucket water. Okay. okay. Did it go? Water. And it goes, but not at that is smooth. Can you ask her? She's got a bucket. She doesn't have because I asked her. I get from other. Nothing feels like it's in there. Uh, you know what happens sometimes, guys? You were here the last time with my sink, remember? 
And it went all over the floor. Oh! Yeah. Oh, yeah. So what happens? Can you explain to him that sometimes the like, idiots upstairs are using like washers and shit? And it laps up my stuff, so it might not even be mine. In the bathroom? No. There shouldn't be anything like a washing machine or anything like that in the what? washroom. But what about if it's like a pipe thing? Tap, oh, tap. It's, with these toilets, you're so sensitive, it's probably going to be... Like a tampon or something? The can, yeah. Yeah. Right? The applicators, right? Yeah. They, because they float. Yeah. Same thing with like uh, Q-tips, floss, flossing <laughs> picks. Hey. Uh, anything no, that no, floats no, 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 no. can get stuck at the bottom of these toilets. Okay. Go. Come here. Go away. Go. 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 Come on, buddy. Go. 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 He's fine, like he's not bothering me. Hey. No, 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 Why are you videoing it? Um, After hours? No, it's honestly, I put it on YouTube. Oh, do you? Yeah. Oh. So I'm going to fill this up. Okay. Uh, I'm going to use your bathtub because yeah, it's ahead. better pressure. No worries. No, 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 no. You cannot do it. No. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. It's this. It's this. The no. tank. Look at it here, okay? I'm going to show you something. You know, it's a weak flush like that? Before it was not. It's this. So it's not me? It's not you. Okay. If you find that it's... Okay. Because like when you put a lot of paper in, yeah. right? Which I'm not telling you not to put a lot of paper. Use what you got to use. Yeah. If you find that it's going slow after that again, it's going to be... There's not enough volume of water flushing through flushing through yeah. because of the style of toilet this is and i believe there's an issue with the tank okay see what happens all right okay if you if you're having issues this weekend call my friend I have here in the bathroom too so. okay so if you're having issues this weekend use your other washroom okay because these guys don't want to come out on the weekend yeah i don't want to come out on the weekend exactly. i will if i have to okay. right um but it's yeah. the Monday morning, let the let the management know. Yeah. And then so you'll do that, right? You'll let management know it's not uh, mine. Well he he works for a different company oh, now. You will have to inform in the management. Okay. Yeah. And you're it, gonna write it something. I'm different. gonna write it on the report. Okay, good. Um that they may be hearing from you. Yeah. Um but just go with that. Keep it as is if you're having issues. And if it plugs up, right? Fill that pot yeah. with water. Pour it down here. Okay. If it goes, you know it's the tank. Okay. Then. You know the issues with the tank. All right. All right. Yep. Thank you so much. No problem. You missed your call. Mm. Okay, guys. Now, yeah, you you can Free. go now. <laughs> he's nice. He's a good boy. Yeah. He's he's got a big head on. It. Oh yeah, he's gonna be huge. He's a king porcel. Uh, Purebred. Don't fix him. No, I'm not going okay. to. No. Come here, Bobo. I've seen a, like, I got a. We signed an, over 2500 for him. I yeah, believe he's it. expensive. I got an English staffy. He's a really expensive dog. And the breeder said, like, if you're going to, like, neuter him, whatever, do yeah. it after a year. I saw somebody 
with a pit bull and they mm-hmm. neutered him at like six months yeah and you know a pit bull is the head right the, yeah that's the right big head and no a little body super skinny super skinny head and it's like oh what happened to your dog right he She's wasn't like, ready to develop no um, oh he's trying to give you paw mm-hmm. oh, he likes you yeah, he's a beautiful dog thank you, know, you. he's kind of my dog's same kind of brindle mine's just darker yeah what kind do you have i got an english staff okay yeah yeah he's a king corso Come on. Little teeth. Yeah, my dog like, <laughs> You haven't had any issues with your kitchen again? Not at all. That's good. That's Thank great. You. Uh, sorry for that little flood we had. No worries. It's all good. All right, you have yourself a good night you and a good weekend. Okay. Yeah. Thanks a lot. All right, guys, that was job eight. Uh, we snaked the toilet. I believe there's going to be an issue with that tank, and they're probably going to need to change it out. The back of that tank has a vent and or a siphon and it usually plugs up with toilet paper or just build up over time and they'll have to change that out so let's go on to job number nine all right guys we're going up to job number nine it's going to be a kitchen sink that's backing up let's see what we find how you doing sir you guys got a plug sink well i'll explain what happened okay just throw mine over you're good you're good I was. I was in my kitchen. Okay. I wasn't running any water. Okay. And the water started coming up. Okay. So I think you and your neighbor share the same drain. I think. I can show you a picture or a video. Ah, it's okay. I've seen it all. <laughs> but is it my did it caused by me or somebody else no it's just connected uh in between um there's a y the drain connects inside the wall so but it kind of freaked me out yes i'm sure i'm sure yeah there it is Okay, not a problem. I'm gonna open this up and I'm gonna snake it out for you. Okay. All right. You you want to get anything off the front? No, I'm gonna be working right down here. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I'm just grab my stuff in here. What was your name? Mike. Mike. My name's Jason. Nice to meet you. No, no, no. No, no, if it's backing up by itself, it's never your fault. Like, if I open up the drain and I find this full of food, then okay, we can say, you know what? You're putting a lot of food down, Mike. You shouldn't be putting that much food down. Well, now I'm curious. See, it's draining out slowly. So there's probably only a partial blockage in there. No, no, if it's backing up by itself, yeah, it's definitely an emergency. Because you don't know if it's coming from just next door or if it's coming from up above, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah.
But it could be your neighbor if you guys share the same grain. Um, but it could be in the stack. If it's in the stack, uh, nobody else will feel the problem except for you because you're the, like it'd be plugged up just below your unit. way to another job. I actually live out by Hamilton. So my next call is in Mississauga, but I was in Scarborough. So when I got the call, I was on the Don Valley coming up to the 407 to shoot to Mississauga. And I got this call. It's like, all right, Get off on young. That <laughs> <laughs> works for me. Uh, work for me too, because I'd rather be close than be at home and get this call, right? So were there any, any, any stuff? It was probably just grease buildup. That's normally what it is. So we're gonna let that fill up. Hey, you say your bathroom sink is plugged up? No, I thought it was. No, it was oh, it's there. not? No. Okay. Do you have an agreement for towel, Mike? Or the more we can have some of it. Are you sure? Yeah, because I got all the stuff I can see it. Okay, thank you, know. thank you very much. I do appreciate yeah, that. guys that's job number nine off to number 10. all right guys this job number 10 we got a kitchen sink i was told so let's go see what we find hello hi you guys got a plug uh kitchen okay i'm here to take care of that don't worry about that you're fine oh thank you i appreciate that i was gonna say so what's happening okay this happens every fall uh, I think I've been here before, actually. Probably. It's every autumn that happens to me. I just got to pull that out. Oh. Hi. Uh, it gets plugged. Okay. And Can I sit up here? Yeah, yeah, it's fine. And, um... Oh, that's J cloth. And then, so... Oh, no, that's fine. That's fine. Don't worry. Um, when they wash their stuff. So, first comes in, I hear a noise. Okay. And the next time, the suds come up, which is theirs. Um, so... Yeah. Whatever. Up and running a lot better and I'll be on my way. My name's Jay, by the way. I'm Gail. Gail, nice to meet you, Gail. Not a problem. Not a problem at all.
I gotta test the water anyway, so it's gonna be a minute or so. Don't use them. Don't. No, because you're on one of the lower floors, so if a break in the pipe happens because it's an acid, right? They say it's not supposed to eat through pipes, but it's an acid, right? So if you ask any plumber, they'll tell you not to use it, right? So I'm um, one of the ones that also say don't use them. Um, some people think, oh, well, you're just saying that so that you can get the business. No. Honestly, I, um, I would rather, yes, I love making money, right? But if I keep coming back to an issue and it's not gonna look like I'm doing my job, right? I come, I snaked this out, like I snaked it out 67 and a half feet down. I didn't have to go that far. I just wanted to make sure I'm well into the main line. If there's an issue beyond that, the management now has to call us in to do further investigate and do like main line cleanouts and as of right now, they're not doing that, yeah. so they're just getting we us to. Do the can. It's all about money, right? Yeah. So. This happens every fall. Yeah. I'm just waiting. Uh, that's a good sound. Yeah, that's a really good sound. So we're gonna shut that off. I mean, she got good suction, good drainage, right? Okay. So, um, is it a bug? A bug. That with the wing. Here? Don't touch it! Don't touch it! Could be a bug. Nah, there's just a piece of dirt. From oh, okay. Could have been from my cable or anything. Okay. No, if it was a bug, I wouldn't be touching it. Believe all right, all right. me. I'm good, so good. terrified of bugs. You're normal. It's... Good. <laughs> um. So yeah, Gail, I think you're good. Um. Are you going to be awake for a little while? Yeah. Okay, I'd like you to run your hot water. Okay. Maybe 15, 20 minutes. No problem. It's, if I broke any grease off in the drain, I want it to make sure that it gets washed down and doesn't solidify again. No problem. Alright? Yeah. And then you should be good. Put this on because I'm going back into the hallway. We'll see you next time. That's exactly it, eh? Yeah. Alright, Gail. Thank you very much. Thank you. No problem. Everything? What's that? Yeah, I got everything. And I guess we're going to be at the season where you can say, have a Merry Christmas. Because well, yeah, I won't is. see you, right? Yeah. <laughs> there you go. Have a good night, Thank Gail. You. Thank you. Bye now.
All right, there you go, guys. Uh, job number 10 down. Um, as of right now, I got no other calls. If I do any more tonight, I will come back. If not, I'm gonna say this has been a great day. Um, so until next time, sure out now.